Lesson 12.1, Classify and Count by Color. We classify and count objects by color by putting all objects of that color in one category and all other colors in another category. When we classify objects, we sort them into different sets by following a rule. And we can classify objects by their color. Here we have a set of red fish and not red fish. And we can sort these fish by their colors following the rule that all red fish go on this left side and all not red fish go on the right side. This fish, is this red? No, that's yellow. So that's going to go on the not red side. What about this fish? Is this red? Yes, it is. So we're going to put it on the red side. What about this fish? Is this red? Yes, it's the same color as this one. These are both red. What about this fish? Is this red? This fish is blue. It's not red. It goes on the not red side. How about this fish? This fish is green. It goes on the not red side. And this fish, that's another blue one. That's not red. We can put it over here. This fish, this is yellow. That's not red. So it can go on the not red side. And this fish, yes, it is red. We've sorted them. We've classified them into red and not red. We classified them by their color. A category is a group or a set. And we can sort and classify these shapes into different categories by their color. Here we have four categories of color. Red, blue, yellow, and green. We can put each shape into their correct color category, which means we put them into their correct color group, their correct color set. Here we have a yellow shape. We can put that in the yellow. Here we have a red one. We could put it into the red category, the red set. Here we have a green shape. We could put that into the green set. Here we have another red that can go into the red set. Here we have another green that goes into the green set. Here we have another red. We can put that in the red set. Here we have a yellow that can go in the yellow set. And here we have blue that can go into the blue set. Their shape doesn't matter. Only the color is important. Here we have a number three on the side. We need to circle the categories or category that contains three shapes. Which category contains three shapes? If you said the red one, you're right. One, two, three shapes are in this red category. We need to circle it. And how many categories had three shapes in them? Just one, just the red one. We need to write the number one over here. One category contained three shapes. These shapes are sorted and classified into two categories. Can you see what the categories are? Can you figure it out? What do we notice about this set? What do they have in common? What is the same about them? If you said they're all yellow, you're correct. And what do you notice about this set? Well, these are different colors, aren't they? These are not yellow. So the two categories for these shapes are yellow 
for this set and not yellow for this set. Because we're classifying them by color, their shape is not important. When we classify objects, we sort them. We sort them into a category. A category is a set or group. And in this lesson, we used color. We used red, blue, green, and yellow. In our next lesson, 12.2, we're going to classify and count by shape. I hope you have a wonderful day. I hope you'll join me for the next lesson, and I really hope you'll hit that like button. When you hit the like button, it helps other people find my videos to help them. Bye.